stop saying uh you know every 5 minutes just we are all like, working on that saying like 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 you know just <laughs> i know it's so stupid to say but you do so much of it what it happens you notice it in yourself the first thing i felt was that's what i sound like like that's my yeah. voice <laughs> like i didn't know i sounded like that your character neeti is a genius i mean she's top of her class she's just so smart i want to ask you what were you like in school i was just one of those kids in school that just went to school because you have to go to school hi everybody my name is sakshma shrivastava and i hope that all of you are happy and healthy today on the show i have elise the new talent on the block Hi, how are you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? I like what you said. Happy and healthy. Uh, <laughs> yes, that's really that good. So uh, affirmations to give out there before you start an interview. Yes, good vibes for the things that really matter. You look gorgeous. Have yeah, you had a long day? day you. <laughs> and also, I would like to thank you for the cookies you sent for Christmas. They were you delicious. Say, I really <laughs> like them. I love them. Okay, now we have to talk about Ferre. Uh, it is going to be streaming on Z5 starting April fifth. Yes. Uh, the first thing I want to ask you is that you won the Filmfare Award for the best debut female for this film. Did it increase your confidence after you win the award as an actress? So the reaction that I got after I won it, um, a lot of people were messaging me. I didn't realize how many people. followed film fair and you know all over the world i was getting messages from people that i hadn't spoken to in years and that okay. was really amazing and and it was such a nice way to connect with everyone again and speak about the film and i think the visibility that film fair gave me for my work is just i'm really grateful for that and now we have to get this question out of the way i know everybody wants to know so everybody knows your salman khan's and these yeah. my question to you is the choice you make for your career is one of the biggest choices you'll ever make him being one of the greatest superstars we've ever had was there a particular piece of advice that he gave you and if you're okay to share it with us there wasn't like one particular piece of advice but i learn a lot just by observing him and um, what was the greatest thing he did for us was that he loved the movie uh, after he watched it he decided to be the presenter of the film and oh. to back us skf was not part of the film when we were making it they joined uh later after watching the film and it, it was it you know sometimes people don't need to say it their actions say so much more and he didn't really need to i mean i we were family we love each other but just going out of your way um for somebody and for a film uh that was really the best thing he did for us i mean all the advice and stuff was great but actually executing that love and that advice you know for your family and going ahead and supporting that that was that was so amazing of him and i'm grateful for that how nice now uh, i know you're relatively new i want to ask you are you completely comfortable in front of the camera yet do you know your angles and have you found your style or you're working on it i uh, i don't like i mean i i love being on set like being on set is like being at home for me i love it i forget the camera is there like a good 90% of the time i'm still you know like just like the whole like paparazzi and you know interview and that kind of space i'm still learning like okay this is the how the body language should be stop saying uh you know every 5 minutes just <laughs> we are all like working that. on that personality interactions because i'm quite shy and i'm quite awkward generally so it's those things that i need to work on the urs and saying like 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 you know just <laughs> i know it's stupid to say but you do so much of it what it happens you notice it in yourself so much more and, and yeah. those things i want when you watch your videos the first thing i felt was that's what i sound like like that's my yeah. voice like i didn't know i sounded like that so you slowly grow you more, see more of your work you see other people when you work with them yes, you observe yes. them on set so it's a journey of course that's what say experience teaches you a lot more than you ever will your character neeti is a genius i mean she's top of her class she's just so smart what were you like in school like were you a nerd a geek or you were like a brat did you do your homework on time what were you like i was just one of those kids in school that just went to school because you have to go to school and yeah. do your homework because you have to i never enjoyed it um i actually wish if i had more clarity back then then i could have you know maybe done more creative stuff then and known that that's what i wanted to do with my life but at that point i was just like i was still figuring things out and i didn't really know what i wanted to do and i was mostly focused on like okay i want to you know go to college abroad and like silly kid things you think about at that time you know you don't hmm. think about all these serious things uh, yeah. and i didn't take my studies seriously at all <laughs> uh, 
until I started doing what I love. Uh, only then, you know, I realized which is acting, like, which is working in films. Yeah. Oh, okay. uh, only then I was like, okay, so this is what it feels like to get good grades and win awards and be appreciated and all of that. Well, I'm happy that you you're doing what you love. I think. That is a blessing for yes. like a lot of people. Now I'm going to move on to a rapid fire, five questions, like really fast and like just one word, or like whatever okay, comes to great. your mind. Okay. Great. Who was your favorite co-star in the movie? Prasanna. An actor you want to work with? Ah, uh, Tabu. Oh wow! Oh, I love Tabu. <laughs> okay, a director you want to work with? Meghna Gulzar. Wow. Okay. Growing up, uh, is there an actress who inspired your personal style of acting or dressing? I think. I'm very inspired by Rekha. Very inspired. I really like actresses from like the seventies and eighties. Parveen Babi, Zina Taman. Uh, yeah. I what I liked about what they did. I know it's a one word answer, but what I did is that they were very individual. So that's what I try and take from that the ind- individuality. And so bold, like in terms of their choices, like like the yeah. all the actresses you named, they were like they were ahead of their time. I think that's I the know. one thing in common in all of them. Yeah, and that's what I like taking from them. You know, just that at that time it was more about your personality, showing your personality more than just the trends. Uh, so you, you know, it's not like okay, this is trending, so I'm just gonna wear that. Yeah. It was like they didn't care about trends. They had to, you know, a lot of the times do their own hair and makeup, get the outfits made from scratch. Like there was no stylists and this and that. It was a different time, and I learn a lot from that. Can you do your hair and makeup like for a movie? I can do my makeup. Yeah, I mostly like especially for these like you know not big events where I'm not working. I always do my own mm. makeup. Hair, no, but makeup, yes. Very similar. Hair is very tricky because I can't see at the back of my head, so I don't know exactly. what it looks like. <laughs> the second I can see that, that's when I'll do my hair. <laughs> yeah, I need eyes at the back of my head, then I'll do it. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, last one. Favorite memory from the sets of Funny. I think the most bittersweet memory was our last day. The last day of the four of us together um, was this bittersweet but very happy memory uh, that I, I'll carry with me for my whole life. Yeah, of course, and also because it was your first movie, it will definitely yeah. be special. There's yeah. only one first film. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time, and uh, I really Thank enjoyed talking so to you for real. I think you're very candid. And um, I wish you all the best for your upcoming projects, and I'm truly like very excited to see you on screen. Thank so, you so much. Best. I had a great time talking to you as well. Thank you. Bye bye. Take care. Bye.